This is Albatross. She's a lovely 57-foot cruise astern narrowboat built in 2004 by Hicks and Hulls and she was fitted out by stem to stern. She had a survey in June 2022. Some very minor observations there. That's all been sorted out. She's just been blacked July 2022. And she's just had a full repaint in the summer of this year, 2022. Nine coats of paint on her and it's a lovely job too. Go anywhere length, popular cruiser stern. The cruiser stern itself is seven feet nine inches long, so it's lovely social space. Mixture of portholes and bustile windows. Decent sized side hatch there for the galley. It's conventional layout, so saloon, galley, bathroom, bedroom going from the front towards the back. Very nice size well deck as well, actually. Five feet long. The gas bottles are in that locker in the bows, two 13 kilo propane bottles. The water tank's under the deck here. Stainless steel, 450 litres, and the storage under the bench seats that go round the, the well deck here. A quick look in here. There are the gas bottles. There is an anchor in there as well. She's got good outside space, front and back. Glazed front doors and bulkheads. It's a nice light boat, actually. And then we go. She's fitted out in beach face ply with oak trim. And the floor is wood effect vinyl in the saloon and bedroom and tiled elsewhere. It's a good sized room, this. It's 14 feet 11 inches long. Empty at the moment, but plenty of room for sofa, bed, armchairs, whatever you want to put in, really. There's quite good storage in here as well. Got an attractive cupboard on the port side corner. Same on the other side. There's a TV aerial point in here, connected to a MaxView Gazelle Pro aerial. Sounds like I don't want to talk about it, never heard of it, but anyway, it's got an aerial. Couple of shelves there. You can see a radiator there. There are three of those on board and a towel rail heated by a Hurricane 4.9, a 9.4 kilowatt diesel fired central heating system. Head height on the boat six foot three. All the lighting is LED. Nice little dining table there. And into the kitchen. The galley is nine feet five inches long. Very good size room. There's lights in those cupboards. It's quite attractive. Loads of storage in here. The worktops are laminate with hardwood edge, and there's cupboards under here. Very well thought out kitchen, actually. Bank of four drawers there. The fridge itself is a 12 volt shoreline fridge with an ice box. Little shelf there, another radiator. And there's a side hatch on the starboard side here. There's the cooker. It's a country ledger oven. Grill and four burner gas hob. All nice and clean. And there is a, another cupboard up here. Stainless steel sink. And there's a DeLonghi microwave in the cupboard at the bottom there. And some shelves there, so plenty of storage in here, everything else you'll need in a, in a kitchen. Plenty of preparation surface. All the lights on board, by the way, are halogen. And then we go through this glazed door to the bathroom. There's a Thetford cassette loo. Two spare cassettes on board. That basin is ceramic over the cupboard. And got my nattering loudly outside. Cupboard above the sink there. And a quadrant shower with sliding doors and tiled surround. So out we go. So there's a door either side of the bathroom here, so it's a walkthrough arrangement, and into the bedroom. 
bathroom, by the way, was six feet long and the bedroom's nine feet five inches. There's cupboards over the length of the bed and above the head end. The bed itself is six foot long, four feet wide. The storage underneath. There's a reading light above the head end there. Some drawers here. There's the two spare cassettes. Not drawers, rather, doors. Another radiator in here. So there's an awful lot of storage, I think, on board. There's the catch, yeah, need to undo that. There's a wardrobe here, double wardrobe. And the top half of that left hand door does open. And on the other side, the electrics. The inverter is a Struder 2.5 kilowatt inverter charger. Various bits of navigation equipment in there. And up onto the stern deck. As I mentioned, 7 feet 9 inches long. There's the engine, it's our Zuzu 38. The battery's on the left of the screen. There's three domestics, 125 amp hours each, and one starter. Nice rail around the back to perch on when you're motoring. And there's a the view from the helm. Let's have another walk back through. Really nicely presented this boat. Clean, tidy, well looked after. There's also a Mastervolt battery link battery monitor. There is a landline hookup point. Hot water on board is heated by the engine and the Hurricane diesel fired central heating system. And you've got ropes and poles, hook, mooring pins, piling aisles, irons, windlasses. You're ready to go. So there we go. Really nice feeling boat, this one. That's Albatross. For further photographs, a fully downloadable colour brochure and the price, go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk.